Terry Johnson, one of the co-creators of the Quirkles. Today I'm here with a true science lover. What's your name? Bo. Bo. And Bo, how old are you? Nine. Nine. And Bo, do you like science? Yes, I love it. You love it. And what's your favorite thing about science? Uh, my favorite thing about science is because there's so many aspects and you can't learn them all. That's right. And do you like experiments? And what about the quirkles? I love the quirkles. Okay. Well, we are here today because Earth Day is coming up. April 22nd, we will celebrate our 35th Earth Day. So we are going to do some activities that will go along with our Exe Ecology book. We are going to talk a little bit about the Earth as we create an Earth model. Now, as we know, Bo, the Earth is in layers, isn't it? Yes. So let's take our red Play-Doh, and we're just going to get a little pinch of our red Play-Doh because this is going to be the core. Now, the core, we're going to do it just like that and roll it. The core is the hottest part of the Earth, almost as hot as the sun. but. You would think with it being that hot, it would be a liquid, right? Yes. But it's not. It is a solid because there is so much pressure on it. So the core is the hottest part of the earth. So we're gonna put that right there. And then we're gonna get our orange Play-Doh. This is gonna be the outer core. Now the outer core is much like the inner core, except it is a liquid. It is a liquid because there's not quite as much pressure on it. Now we're going to kind of take our orange, flatten it out, and we're going to wrap it around our core. Now the core and the inner core of the earth is made out of iron and nickel. Our next layer of the earth is the mantle, and we're going to make that purple. Now the mantle, in addition with the crust, is where our plate tectonics takes place. So we're going, that's the movement of the earth. Are you getting a good layer formed there? And we're going to completely cover it. So now, we, what do we have, Bo? We have our core, outer core, and mantle. That's right. So we're missing one last piece, aren't we? So our outer crust is going to be blue. And the reason, why would we make it blue, though? Why do you think we'd make our outer crust blue? Because there's a lot of water on the surface. That's right. Most of our earth is water, isn't it? Yes. And actually, our crust is the thinnest layer of all the layers. Kind of take your stick, and we are going to just cut our earth in half. Let's cut it in half this way. And we're going to see, when we lift it up, if we can see the layers that we have formed. Very cool. You see your core, your outer core, your mantle, and your crust, don't you? Very cool. All right. You know all about this, don't you, Bo? Yes. What is this, Bo? Styrofoam. Styrofoam. And how do we get styrofoam? Do you know how styrofoam is made? No. Well, it's poly, It's actually called polystyrene. And what they do, styrofoam is a trade name. So it is just like a company has named it styrofoam. What they do is they take air and they pump into a plastic. It's a plastic. Now, there's a lot of debate about using styrofoam. Why do you think there would be debate about using that? Because styrofoam isn't decomposable for a long time. It takes a long, long, long time, you are right, to decompose styrofoam. So, let's see if we can get our styrofoam into its natural state. Now, what I put in your bowl was acetone. This is 100% acetone. You would not be able to use anything less than 100% to do what we're going to do today. Now, just take your cup and then your stick, and we're going to see how we can decompose this cup and look what's happening. Are we recycling? Are we reducing? What are we doing, Bo? Reducing. We're definitely reducing it. And we're reducing it to its hard, natural 
state. And this, is, if we let that dry and get all the acetone out of it, you are going to get a gooey plastic now, but when that dries, that will become a hard plastic. Thank you for working with me today, Bo. Tell everyone happy Earth Day. Happy Earth Day. Check us out on our Quirkles YouTube or our Quirkles.com. Happy Earth Day. Thank you for joining us. Bye-bye. Say bye-bye. Bye-bye.